All new for you tonight, we're taking a deeper dive into the HVAC technician shortage that's happening right now all across North Texas. This has been going on for about a decade, but as extreme heat continues, you at home may notice a longer wait time or clearly some higher prices. CBS News Texas, on your corner and in your corner. Alexis Wainwright explaining how one local HVAC company is working hard, all in the name of comfort. Hi, this is Dustin with AAA Air Conditioning. How can I help you today? Business has been heating up here at AAA Air in Irving. We try to take care of many people as we can. Um, so uh, it definitely, we could run, we can always run more calls if we had more people. But it's been hard to help everyone because of an ongoing technician shortage the business is facing. It's been a struggle. It, it's definitely causing some issues with uh, contractors, different HVAC contractors being able to get to consumers in timely manners because of the shortage. Jennifer Bardo with the Texas Air Conditioning Contractors Association of North Texas, Austin and Houston says some of the HVAC business owners are having to respond to calls themselves because they can't find experienced help. They're also going to see, um, you know, price differences. It, you know, they're having HVAC contractors are having to pay um, technicians a much higher rate than they typically were, you know, five years ago. Um, so that getting somebody and having keep paying them what they feel they deserve to keep them around and, and get that loyalty is unfortunately passed on to the consumer as well. But general manager Dustin Neff has taken a different approach. We, we haven't had the best luck uh, with hiring recycled um, tech, so we have really started going to the green option. Neff there says he's now focusing on the future. He started a program at Louisville ISD where students can earn their technician certification and head straight into the workforce. So that is kind of the big focus is trying to get these young people motivated um, because this is a hard job. It was it was a great opportunity and I took advantage of it and you know also not having to make that that big commitment to be like man I'm gonna go spend this much money on the career instead you just you just go to a couple classes and then you get all your certifications from there i mean sky's the limit nev says that majority of the staff at his small family owned business are young and eager to learn it, it meant the world it meant the world i mean i know right out of school i didn't know much and these guys took the biggest chance on me Two, three. a chance nev is willing to take as the experienced techs leave the business high school program we had an internship this year our first one with one of the juniors which was really great he did awesome um, and then we hired our first senior this year as well and uh, he's been doing really he's been doing really good i think he's going to catch on quick so i'm excited about the future in irving alexis wainwright cbs news texas